So the Foreign Quality Assurance Scheme is basically a guarantee of quality. We have a scheme in place so that we can say to consumers, we're going to give you an assurance about the beef and lamb that's produced here in Northern Ireland. The Foreign Quality Assurance Scheme will have 84 standards at the farm, and that covers a range of areas. That covers stockmanship, animal welfare, and a key element is, is traceability, but also goes on to cover animal nutrition, care for the environment, uh, farm safety, farm procedures. So it covers a very wide range of things that consumers care about. When they eat beef and lamb, they want to be sure they're getting a product that they can trust, and that's being produced to the standards that they, they ultimately require and expect. And what we're about in terms of foreign quality assurance is delivering for the consumer. When you see the foreign quality assurance logo on a pack of beef and lamb, that basically means to the consumer that's the that's product that they can trust. It's quality. But it's quality not that the Livestock and Meat Commission has, has said, it's quality that's independently checked. We developed the Food Fortress Scheme a number of years ago to look after the integrity of the animal feed materials that come from all parts of the world into Northern Ireland to make sure what goes into our animals is safe. We believe that the testing scheme that we have in place, the results that we generate, make us world leaders in feed quality assurance. We don't have a paper passport system in Northern Ireland, it's all done electronically. Whenever livestock are born in Northern Ireland, they're, they're all tagged. Every bovine animal is electronically traced using the centralised computer database, APHIS, the Animal Health Public Information System. Northern Ireland is one of the, the first regions to have that system. It's all about having more information available to the end consumer. One of our advantages in Northern Ireland is that we have an integrated system for public health controls but also for animal health and welfare and we carry out the public health part uh, for the Food Standards Agency who are responsible for the policy but it's my staff that carry out the official controls, the inspections and audits on the ground. We are fully independent and the staff are independent of the meat plants and carry out inspections for the consumer. You know, you can travel anywhere in Northern Ireland in an hour and a half um, so we're not hauling them long, long distances, we're not travelling overnight. They go to the meat plant and the, the, the job is really finished within an hour. Many of the factories in Northern Ireland use DNA technology to provide additional assurances. The factory takes a DNA sample from the animal and trace back can then be used to verify that products have not come in fact from those cattle. For 25 years, um, consumers throughout the world have been recognising the quality assurance programme we have in Northern Ireland. Many countries have imitated what we have done in the quality assurance programme to varying degrees of success. Um, we are still the leading uh, country in the world with the best quality assurance programme and it's ensuring people throughout the world can enjoy the beef and lamb coming from Northern Ireland. <laughs>